Hey guys, about two years ago I showed you my movie ticket collection so I thought I'd just do an updated one now on all the tickets I've got since essentially movies I've seen in the theatre since so last we left off uh, was the 10th of March 2009 Watchmen so the next one after that was The Bird the Rock sorry if you, some of these you can't see too well that was the 3rd of April 2009 The Bird Rock and the next one after that was, if I can get it, State of Play on 1st of May 2009 There's a little theatre and then after that it was 14th of May 2009 Angels and Demons and after that it was 16th of May 2009 Star Trek and then on the 27th of May 2009, let the right one in and also on the 27th of May 2009, Drag Me to Hell. Excellent film. Then on the 16th of June 2009, Transformers 2, Revenge of the Fallen. Disappointing, really. I mean, come on. I'm not expecting high art, but we can do better than that, Mr. B. Mr. Michael B. Then on the 19th, 17th of June 2009, Terminator Salvation. There's the wrong way around for some reason. Don't even know why that is. So it should be Terminator Salvation and then Transformers 2. 10th of July, Bruno. Crap. That's no shit. Uh, and then the 15th of July, 2009, Public Enemies. And I think, yeah, also on the 15th of July, Harry Potter and the Half Blood Prince. Again on the 15th, that was a triple bill that day. It's the only time I've ever done that. Select K New York. And then the 26th of July, 2009, In the Loop. That's a quality film in the loop. Uh, 26th of July 2009, Moon. Moon, I don't know if you can... I know the little theatre ones are probably hard to see. 2nd of uh, September, Final Destination 4 in 3D. I think that was the first 3D movie I saw. They're not that great, to be honest. Inglorious Bastards, also on the 2nd of September. That was an odd double bill that day. Did a lot of double bills in 09. Uh, 9th of September 09, District 9. I saw a lot of movies that year in the cinema as well, really a lot more than I usually do. And then this was 17th of September, Gamer. Uh, 3rd of October 2009, Morris, A Life with Bells On. That was an obscure little mockumentary. Uh, uh, 9th of October 2009, Zombieland. Love it. 23rd of October, up in 3D. It's a good flick, but I uh, didn't need to see it in 3D, did I really? Uh, then the 24th of October, Back to the Future Part 2. That was awesome seeing that in cinema. And then, uh, da -da -da -da. 3rd of November 2009, Cold Souls. And also on, th uh, sorry, 13th of November, not 3rd of November. And also on 13th of November, The Informant, which wasn't very good. Did not like the informant. Uh, then on the 6th of December 2009, The Box. The Box. That's a good. I like that. It's an underrated film, I think. Then on the 17th of December, Avatar in 3D. Twilight New Moon on the 4th of January 2010. I don't know if you can see that. Twilight New Moon. Yes, I saw one of the Twilight films in the cinema. Guilty as charged. 3rd of January, 3rd, sorry, 30th of January 2010, A Prophet. I think that makes up for Twilight. Then, oops, uh, then 28th of February 2010, The Crazies remake. Crazies. Then it's The Sin World. 24th of March 2010, Shutter Island. So we're in London. On the 31st of March 2010, Kick Ass. Kick ours, as they might say in the UK. Uh, 30th of April 2010, Iron Man 2. 12th of May 2010, Robin Hood, the Ridley Scott one, which was rubbish. Uh, 8th, 8th of July 2010, Predators. 16th of July 2010, Inception. I haven't seen that since actually. Inception. 
uh, 20th of July 2010, Toy Story 3 in 2D. I was adamant about seeing that in 2D. Yeah, it's Toy Story, you don't want to ruin it with 3D. Um, 28th of July 2010, the A-Team. Meh. Uh, 30th of August 2010, Scott Pilgrim vs. The World. And this is the only one I've forgotten to keep in since Harry Potter 3 and Trek 2. This is another year on 7th of November 2010. I put 11 there for some reason, but it's 2010. Um, another year. Yeah, I was so pissed when I forgot to keep it. Because, you know, I had a brilliant track record. The only ones in all those years I've forgotten to keep were Harry Potter, Prisoner of Azkaban and Shrek 2. And then, oh, just, I suppose it was bound to happen sometime, wasn't it? Like, can you see that? Uh, beautiful, which was 20th of November 2010. Uh, 23rd of November 2010, Harry Potter, Harry Potter Deathly Hallows Part 1. Then, what was this? 11th of December 2010, Monsters. Uh, so a lot of people seem to either hate or love that film. I thought it was good, I liked it. I think people are expecting something a little more exciting. So some people find it boring. Uh, and then this was 15th of December on my birthday, Rare Exports, Christmas Story. That was a weird little film. I liked it though. Uh, then on the 22nd of December 2010, Tron Legacy in 3D. That was just a visual feast, wasn't it? Visual feast. Um, 21st of January 2011, Black Swan. That was an amazing film. I thought Black Swan was brilliant. And then 24th of January 2011, uh, Green Hornet in 3D. I liked Green Hornet, but 3D was unnecessary for that film. And I didn't see any films for a while, and then it was 5th of April 2011 with Source Code. That was a very, I really liked Source Code a lot, so that was really good. And the same month, 15th of April 2011, Scream 4. Don't care what everybody says, Scream 4 I thought was awesome, I loved it, I thought it was fantastic. 5th of May 2011, Saw in 2D. I don't know why they need to put 2D down there. It doesn't say 3D, it's not in 3D. 2nd of June 2011 was X-Men First Class. Also thought that was very good. And then on the 22nd of June 2011, Kung Fu Panda 2. That film was, I loved Kung Fu Panda 2, I thought it was great. And then on the same day, 22nd of June 2011, Green Lantern in 3D. Meh. Thought that was so-so. And then 29th of June, 2011, Transformers 3, Dark of the Moon, uh, which was definitely a lot better than Transformers 2. Still, these films are just too long, aren't they? They're just way too long, but I liked, I thought Transformers 3 was the best one of them all, if you ask me. So that's all we have recently. Maybe in another two years I'll do another one. That went from The Boat That Rocked in April 2009 to Transformers 3 in, in June 11. So... Maybe I'll do another one of these in a couple of years. Okay, see ya. Peace. Subscribe, motherfuckers. Yeah, bitches.